welcome back everybody. Well, this is to show off my new shop. There's my water, my drain, and all that. Got my sink. I even got hot water. Let me put that little bit of instant hot water there. So I can wash my set of my hands. Got my welder set up here. And I got my rags there. This electronic parts, oil, bolts. I went through all my cans and separated bolts out so I know what's where. Hose clamps, drill, metal cutting. So I'm going to set it up here. My box, workbench. Right now, the fan in front of it. Because <laughs> it's hot. So I got some of my old motors here. And uh, that's where I clean up stuff at. My um, wing cleaner. Got my tires and rims there. This is my construction stuff over this side, as you can see. Over there. And got some four wheelers over there too. So. I got concrete, this is in my shed, so I moved my whole four-wheeler operation over here so I can get it out of the garage and keep that so the wife don't have to smell all the stinky oil, oil, grease, and whatever. We can make that nice and then I can have this spot over here try to be organized so I can, uh, <clears throat> or it's got the TV up there, got to get the antenna set up. So we'll be working on this. You'll probably see this on a video coming up. Change out the brakes. This one has some issues. Um, it runs. You see where I had to put in because these are known for killing the uh, starter gear. So this runs. What's that? So it acts like it's, you know, reverse. I didn't push the reverse overdrive. Still does it, so. Still working on that. Trying to think of, figure that out. Sometimes they got to sit and you just think about them. So yeah, this is it. We're getting more concrete. Going to be from here over there, 25 feet. 25 feet. And then the full length over there. All the way to here, all the way there. So we're getting more and more concrete, but I'll wash things out here without getting in the gravel. It's a mess. And eventually we're going out the door, out here, and out there. Eventually. And here's this side here. Got the bobcat out here. I don't know if I'm going to keep it there or not. This is generally where I put my wood for the winter, which I need to get on cutting. That's up there. Those logs up there. Trash. All right, everybody. Well, here it is. This is where you're going to be getting got everything settled in. Finally, it took a lot of time to go through everything, scrap, throw away, and to get to this point. So now I'm ready to do something, get some things going. Everybody, hey, thanks for watching, and those are subscribe. We'll keep moving this forward. I'll try to put out some more videos. Um, I just been busy on different things, so I wanted to bring you this. And I got a video right after this of laying the concrete and who did it. It's a CNC concrete here out of Troy. Excellent. We're good guys. Give them a call. You'll have the phone number. It's on the video. All right, everybody. Enjoy the next video of the concrete being poured. And take care and have a good one. And thanks for watching. Getting the concrete. This is where I'm going to have my. Getting concrete. This is where I'll have my new shop. The shop's going to be in here for doing the four wheelers. 
So I had to get concrete and get in there. We're going to get a 10 foot, 8 foot out here. And uh, have a new place to do work on four wheelers. Get out of my garage. And uh, show you the guy that's helping me do this. My neighbor down the road. He works really good. We got the concrete trucks all backed up. So we got CNC concrete. The one's helping me get this going. CNC concrete around the Troy area here. So if anybody needs some concrete, this is the guy to call. CNC concrete. So just a little update on that, and I'll be. It's gonna be a while, but I'll get things straightened out and start working on the four wheelers in there. I need a. So I talked about getting out of the garage, getting into here. So there it is. Well, this was my pole barn. I had a store before with it, but I'm going to have one section over there. I uh, should have at least one, a uh, half of that. It'll be a place I can work on four wheelers in there. So that's what we're working on. And an upcoming, the new shop.